Wow. Hello guys, welcome to Merch Benz King. In front of me we have the all new facelift Mercedes AMG GLE Coupe. And in this video I will show you the full exterior changes, the interior design and of course the newest technology with the new steering wheel. So I've got the key right here with a beautiful AMG lettering in the front and it is fully blacked out because of the Night 2 package and it does match the front design because we have blacked out front bumper parts, beautiful new design with the jet wing which is new for the facelift and of course the Panamericana grill with only one chrome line. Plus it has a beautiful AMG lettering. And yes, the facelift comes with a new multi-beam LED headlights. So we have beautiful four stripes per headlight with one line above. And it looks beautiful, very sportive with the jet wing design. So let's move over to the side to admire the beautiful coupe of this GLE. It does have the new tail lights that I will show you a little bit later, but just check out the nice two package with blacked out contours around the window tinted windows in the back and of course beautiful 22 inch AMG rims matte black. I really love it with a Mercedes star in the center and these are actually winter tires so it is a little bit thicker but beautiful on these 22 inch rims. Also pretty expensive I have to say. So let's move over to the coupe line where you can see beautiful connections in design and of course the spoiler on the coupe very broad stand and yes there is also some definition on the glass and this is of course the rear brake light so let's open the trunk and there you can see it opens beautiful alongside the coupe line and yes you have this cover inside that you can just fold for more trunk space let's put it back let's close the trunk and we'll head to the interior to take this beautiful GLE 53 AMG for a drive here in Zurich. Soft closing doors of course and let's buckle up. Beautiful interior with glossy carbon fiber. I will just press the button for the electronics to work. There we have a beautiful view with two 12.3 inch screens. I will press the button again for all the electronics to work, including the satellite buttons on the steering wheel. And let's pull it into Sport Plus because we will start the engine with the Emotion Start. I will hold the downshift and press the button. Let's pull it into Drive. You do hear the engine a lot, so I will just close the panoramic roof as it was tilted. We will wait for the G-Wagon to pass and we will take a left turn. Nice pops and bangs. And of course in Sport Plus the suspension is quite stiff. So as we are in the city, let's put it into comfort mode. So we can also enjoy some comfortness that the GLE provides. I will just set a random destination. And with that, we also have the augmented reality camera that appears at almost every corner. So right now, the navigation tells me to take a left turn and you can see the screen is very crisp and clear with nice saturation. Let's accelerate. And even in the comfort mode, it sounds very aggressive. You have this constant rumble of the exhaust sound. You can even activate the exhaust button with the satellite down here. So if you press the button, 
it will turn red and you will also see it on the display in front of us. And it is a shame that we don't have a miniature GLE, just like in the S-Class. But this has to do with the new facelift and in my opinion, because they took the newest MBUX technology and fitted it in the older screens. Because this MBUX technology is actually meant for the portrait style screen. There we are in beautiful Zurich city, close to the lake. I will take a right turn. In front of us a Mercedes S-Class and a GT. So let's put it into Sport Plus. Let's listen. With nice pops and bangs. And the seating position is also great. You really look over other cars, even with a Q5 in front of us. And we also have the new head-up display monitor. So if we zoom in, we can actually change the content. For example, into race with the RPM. You can change it right here by using the touchpad. The touch buttons. Let's leave it on standard with the navigation system. So approaching the section, again a beautiful augmented reality and it is included with the traffic light view. So you could see it zoomed out a little to show you where the whether the light turns green. There it zooms in to show you with the lines that you have to take a right turn. I will just quickly tilt the roof and listen to the sound. Amazing. You can also change the view, for example, to Super Sport, and then the gain just change. For example, in Super Sport, and there the gauges change with the RPM and the gear in the center. Wow. There we have a beautiful E53 with a similar engine as this GLE 53 AMG. You can already see beautiful blacked out design with chrome exhaust tips. What do you think? Chrome or black exhaust tips? In the Sport Plus suspension, it is stiff and very fast around the corners, very agile. But of course you can also change the driving characteristics. Even though you are in Sport Plus, you can say that you want the suspension in comfort mode and the AMG Dynamics to, let's say, advanced. But it will stay in Sport Plus. So guys, thanks for watching Merz Benz King. I hope you liked the video with the all new GLE 53 AMG Coupe and I hope to see you guys next time. Bye bye.